Okay, Nvidia, very interesting here, guys, right? Very interesting. Uh, looking at those 245 calls. Right, above Okay, so watching closely here, right? Watching closely over that 242.77. Okay, watching closely. All right, guys, I am in, or trying to get in. 434 average price, 434 average price. Let's see if this thing can finally give us an immediate pop here. Give us that 10% and, and turn this into a uh, nice day here. So let's see if this thing has legs for us, right? We're in pretty good shape so far on this NVIDIA. Let's see if this thing can keep going for us, uh, creep up towards that 245 target. We're in not bad shape though, right? Not bad shape. So let's see if this thing can keep going. So as we creep up towards that like 475, right? 480 target. Going to look to take about uh, one quarter of my position off and then let the remainder run. So I'm going to take off, um, I'm going to take off one third of my position here at this 480 and then lock in a, uh, the remainder here, right? Entry protection mode. So uh, I'm going to try to take off one third of my position here at 480, 
right? And then let's see if this thing can keep climbing towards that 245 area. So locking in a little bit of profit, right? Making sure I cannot go red on this play at 10%. And now let's see if this thing can kind of keep giving us a little bit of follow through up. Stop loss on my remainder, guys. There we go. Locked in some profit. Stop loss on my remainder here now going to be at 450. So protecting entry, protecting a uh, net 5% win. Let's see if this thing can keep going, but in really, really good shape here. Anyone in this uh, NVIDIA here with me? There we go, guys, right? Green on the day. Let's go. So let's see if this thing can keep climbing, pushing up towards that 20%. So let's see if we can keep getting a bit of follow through here, but in really, really good shape. Have nothing else to do besides watch this play keep climbing. In at 434, current price, four, sorry, 525. So in really, really good shape. Let's see if this thing can keep going. Let's go, guys, right? Let's go. This thing is absolutely flying on us now. So really good shape here, 25%. Going to look to take off uh, probably another little bit, right? There's that 245 touch. So if we can get a, a little bit up and over this 245, right? Going to take a little bit more off. Uh, take off another original one-third. So I'll have a, a one-third of my original position left here if this thing can go. Stop loss, still that 450. Uh, now starting to maybe look a bit like a rejection off of that 245. So let's even creep back up towards that target. Take a little bit more off there. But uh, cannot let this trade go red here now, right? So really good job if you guys are in this. Hopefully we can keep getting a bit more follow through. Just could not get that uh, sustained hold of that 245 yet. But it doesn't mean it's over and done with here at the moment. Still very much in play. Going to take off uh, another one third of my original position here at around that uh, 550 mark. If we can get 550 on those contracts, it's gonna take off another one third of my original position. Yeah, my pleasure, Michael. Good job, man, good job. So I'll see if this thing can keep climbing up for us, but we're in great shape on this NVIDIA, guys. A little bit of patience, right? A little bit of shake and fake this morning, but we're very much back in play. That risk management is the number one thing that keeps us alive. So there we go, guys. Locked in a little bit more profit there at that 550. Now I have one third of my original position left. Stop loss on this remainder is going to be $5. Let's see if this thing can keep running, but we've got nothing else to do besides watch this play. Just keep climbing. Let's go, guys. Let's go. So remember, guys, right, our number one thing that we can control is our risk management. We can't necessarily control how the market's going to react. We can't control what the market's going to do. And the point of risk management is that we're going to be wrong, right? We're going to make mistakes. We're going to lose. We're going to, to be incorrect. Started the day off 0 for 2, right, but took two very, very small losses um, on half size plays, right? And so that does two things. One keeps me within sort of that one trade parameter. So I'm always one trade away from having a green day. And then two, right, when I keep those numbers small or keep them within that that personal number that I'm willing to, to absorb, right, it allows me to then view the next opportunity or the next setup that I get without being on tilt, right? So what happens is when we have losing trades, we start to see more and more setups, right? We start to see more and more uh, ideas that come together and most of the time those are wrong but if we keep our position sizing appropriate and we're very proactive in managing our risk before we enter a trade even if we're wrong we're still going to look at things with kind of those like um clear eyes full hearts can't lose right like like it, it sounds so stupid to phrase it that way but that that's really what the objective is here right that's the point of risk management is to when you make a mistake or when you're wrong for it to not be a catastrophic game-changing error, right? So all of a sudden we're in at 434 and now these contracts are at six bucks and we're laughing, right? We're loving life because we're able to survive and make good decisions. But if we go all in on every trade, we don't give ourselves a chance to survive a mistake and therefore, right, we don't give ourselves a chance to survive as traders. We're all gonna have red days. We're all gonna have red trades. We're all gonna have red mornings. So it's really just important that we control what we can control and just make sure that we keep trading a numbers game, right? That's the most important thing. It's the number one narrative that we need to be responsible for 
and then everything else sort of takes care of itself. So we're crushing it here, guys, on this NVIDIA, right? Um, this is a huge win all of a sudden. So we don't need to do anything crazy here. Really, really well done. Let's see if this thing can keep going for us. But uh, we've got a little bit of room up towards that 247. I've got one third of my original position left. And, and now, right, we're basically just seeing if we can get a little bit of luck and a little bit of follow through to have a really, really nice day. In general, I'm going to be keeping my stop loss about 10% behind the current price. So as is stop loss, 530 on these contracts. And uh, let's see if we can keep getting a bit of follow through. Did anyone else? Let's go. Let's go. Nice work, everyone. Nice work. So look, the objective here for the end of the, well, for the rest of the week, right, is now hopefully as FOMC gets out of the way, right, if this Ukraine narrative that uh, SF trader is telling us is true, right, then we start to, we're starting to stack up, right, narratives that can help us establish a trend again, right? So we've survived until we can thrive and hopefully we're going to enter a period where we can start thriving again, right? So really good job, everyone. Congratulations. For those of you who are not DTR members and would like to be one, uh, I trade like this every single day, Monday through Friday for members. I do free live streams on Wednesdays. If you go inside my um, or inside the description of this YouTube video, you need access to what's called the Traders Challenge. So this is sort of my uh, how I'm backing you, right? To, for you guys to become profitable traders and, and to kind of make this transaction about running a trading room, right? And teaching you guys how to trade to be as fair as possible. So the deal is you join DTR for three months. You can pay month to month, three months at a time, however you want. If I can't turn you into a winning trader in those 90 days, you get your money back and we move on and we go our, our separate paths, right? I don't think there's any other trading rooms that are offering that deal. Uh, and so that's how it works, right? Become a winning trader, master the DTR principles, you'll become a winning trader in 90 days or less. If you guys want to join, right, the link is down in the description below. So sh should get stopped out here in a second, I'm guessing on this NVIDIA. Yeah, there we go, guys. I'm going to stop, well, not yet. Uh, stop loss 520 on my remainder. So that's where my stop loss. I oh, appreciate you saying that, Rusty. Appreciate you saying that. Uh, trying to make the offer as irresistible as possible, right? There's too many scam artists. There's too many bullshitters out there. I believe in my ability to teach you guys how to trade. And I'm willing to put my money where my mouth is. But you guys got to meet me halfway. So I'm out now of NVIDIA, guys. I got stopped out protecting a very, very nice win, right? In at protecting 25%, right? So we'll never complain about that play Let's go, right? Let's go, guys. Congratulations to everyone who caught that. Great trade. Now we really don't have too much of an expectation to do anything, right?